Former President Donald Trump was held in contempt of court by a New York judge Monday for not providing documents subpoenaed by the state attorney general. Trump will be fined $10,000 per day until he complies. The judge ruled contempt was appropriate because of repeated failures to hand over the materials. Trump was not in the courtroom. Daniel L. Alonzo, a partner in the New York office of Buckley LLP, spoke to Reuters after the judge's ruling. Subpoenas are not optional. Court orders are not optional. People comply with them every single day. Uh, it is very unusual for somebody to just sort of say, look, I'm just not going to comply with this or to just keep arguing even after they've been ordered. And the government, in this case, the attorney general just got fed up. So he's got to comply. Everyone else has to do it. Uh, there's no <laughs> there's no loophole for former presidents. State Attorney General Letitia James is investigating whether the former president's family company, the Trump Organization, misstated the values of its real estate properties to get favorable loans and tax deductions. James has said her probe had found significant evidence, suggesting that for more than a decade, the company relied on misleading asset valuations. A lawyer for Trump and the company said at a hearing that James' investigation was a fishing expedition. Trump, a Republican, denies wrongdoing and has called the investigation politically motivated. James is a Democrat.